just say welcome to my boring life. No. What's going on, bastards? It's the last day of July already. My ting. Yeah, I just said that. Get over it. It's time to get back to what I know best. Making terrible videos. Just waiting for the Xbox to load up. Go and watch Orange is the New Black. The final episode. I think this series has been fantastic so far. You've not watched it. Get on it. It's true life stories. Wink, wink. If you know, you know. And how good is this theme tune for this? Just been the gym, bastard! It's over a week since I've last been, so it was a bit of a struggle. We're back on it. It's gotta be done. You yeah, bastards. So where have I been the last couple of weeks? Being a waste man, that's what. Got a new car, that was it. So in the last vlog, I had the Golf, and now I've got this Volkswagen CC, balling. <sighs> Lucky, yeah, I know. <laughs> Just thought you might want another look. For real though, the main reason that I have uh, not been uploading is one thing, and one thing only. The, I got World Cup fever. So yeah, I got World Cup fever. So yeah, I got World Cup fever. Banging World Cup though, wasn't it? Too bad about England, that was a bit of a bummer. I, re I seriously thought, I'm just gonna bring this bad boy home. I thought this was coming back, back to that bit there. Wasn't to be though, unfortunately. Yeah. Other than that, it's been absolutely boiling. So your body's got to sweat more to keep yourself cool, and that's just no good either. Because then you just your body's working harder than it needs to, than it wants to. So then you're more tired, and the pollen has been kicking my ass too. All excuses, and there shouldn't be. I should have been making videos anyway, but I'm a bitch. That's a uh, certainly a disappointment, really. On the plus side, another one off the bucket list: replica World Cup. A bit little side note: Kylian Mbappe is going to be unreal if he keeps going the way that he's going to. His potential looks like he's going to be, but let's move on. So, like I said, World Cup fever, but proofs in the pudding, or some shit like that. Too true. <laughs> it was all downhill from there. Shit the bed. So you had the first game. There's me. Not the greatest quality, it's kind of dark in there enough. But when Harris Kane scored that late winner, absolute scenes. Never forget that. You had the absolute demolition, the 6 1. You know what I mean? That, what a game that was. You had our first ever penalty shootout victory in the World Cup finals. Here's the moment that we scored the winning penalty. That was just so epic, I can't, <laughs> can't believe that actually happened. What a moment. 
Cheating to Zerith, them cheating Colombian bastards. Not a thing. Take it, Shakira. Take it, Valderrama, bastard. Then it was uh, Carnival Day, during the quarterfinals against Sweden, so we watched it around my auntie's house rather than the club. Everyone got involved, which was awesome. That for me, I think, was the point where I went from like a bit of like an inside joke kind of thing to being shit. I actually believe this. It's come. It's it's written. What happened meant it wasn't written. That's why I'm a dumbass. But you know, still got those memories. Good while it lasted. And then we all know what happened in the um, semi final against Croatia. But at the same time, first semi final in my lifetime. Epic, all the same. It showed what football can do, though. The magic of football for me. Brought everyone together. The country was all buzzing. Everyone was believing. Hopefully the lads build on that. The lads have just got to build on the experience of that World Cup. I know it's gone now and it's been a, been a while since France won it. But I just wanted to put this into one of my vlogs. So that's why it's in this one. Oh, and there's this. Photo bomb. So what else have I been up to? Like I said, I got a new car. You've just seen it. Banging. Other than that, just being really lazy. Because I'm a big fat bastard. I, did go to a, I went to a supercar day. Got to see the Stig. Loads of Teslas. I went in a Land Rover. And it was on one of those Rock Hill climb things. That was cool. Lots of really nice cars there. There's JJ next to a Lamborghini. JJ and Charlie. There's my stupid face. There's me being a dickhead. <laughs> Took the bait. I had to go one of those things, he actually did it. My props. There's me being a fat bastard. JJ being in the police car. No comment. The best bit of the day is obviously spending time with family. Same goes for the World Cup. That was the best bit about that. Spending time with family and actually got into the football. and That was the best bit for me. Everyone was loving it. It was just, it was a great time. Kind of miss it. Anyway. The race supercar day. Also got to go in. That banging McLaren. The guy was... Yeah, he throttled that thing. It was unbelievable. G-forces. I'm going to shit my pants, but not really. You know. It was epic. Basically. It was epic, basically. Epic. That's JJ. That's JJ in a Lamborghini. He went in that first. And then he got to go in an Audi R8. I'm not sure which one it was. There it is, though. That's some F1 cars is there, too. F1. F1 looking cars. Charlie went in an Ariel Atom, and Andrea went in a um, another McLaren. But apparently the guy that Charlie went with was an absolute machine around the track. He knew what he was doing, basically. All the stewards were like, oh, that, this guy's the Don of that day, anyway. The only other thing that I can think of, which happened was I went to a party, Andrea's birthday party. It's not a party, it's just a get together.
Put the candles out. Andrea got a lap dance. From my cousin. <laughs> <laughs> After that, I proceeded to throw everyone in the pool. They'll, they'll try their best. But you don't move a 20 stone tank, man. Amy did it the wrong way, she's a big dog. Dad put her arms out. So yeah, it was. Oh, I think everyone had a good time. I had a great time. That these uh these men things, but Andrews went missing. But he got found again. <laughs> Drinking buddy things. But yeah, that was pretty good. Amy managed not to fall out of anyone. And I went to watch Incredibles 2. And it was incredible too. Shit jokes. I think that pretty much means you're all caught up with what's been going on. Well, mainish things. 
there's probably some stuff I'm missing out, but that's okay. The important thing is you're up to date, and we can move on from this point with the vlog. The footage credit goes to Andrea, Maria, Amy, Chloe. They supplied the footage. Those the ones that did it. So props to them. Like I said, peace out, bonsoir, shalom, bastards. Oh shit, I don't know if I mentioned this, but I got a new car. And a new bestie. My bestie, bestie, she my bestie. That's right.